Hi, it's Dave here from Megapoints Controllers. I thought it might be time to give you a, a quick update on the progress we're making on the System 2 solenoid driver. So I've assembled a test unit on the bench. It's, it's not out yet, but it is out on layout being tested at the moment. So I thought I'd just share with you uh, where we are so far. So this is the solenoid driver uh, for System 2. It's not in white, it's in green because it's a prototype and we don't want to get any uh, have any mix-ups. So this is the board and it's currently hooked up to these four SEEP solenoid motors. And I'm driving it from the uh, System 2 panel controller. So the board takes four solenoids. Um, it's 12 volt DC regulated power supply in, so it's the same supply as every other System 2 board. And from that, it's capable of generating 20 volts via the reservoir capacitor to feed all of the solenoids. So the board has a built-in CDU as well. So I'll just fire them off and you can see them operate. This is a screenshot of the panel controller and it's recognized the four channel solenoid driver. And if I connect to it, and we can see we have the uh, solenoid driver here. The picture's wrong at this point, but that's okay. Um, so we've got the usual V port config and the uh, feedback config. So depending on how the testing goes, uh, we may see this, well, I expect to see it in the summer of uh, 2024. So we're just, uh, we're just really giving it a hard time at the moment, making sure that uh, the unit is robust. The most important thing is we wanted it to be driven from uh, 12 volts and we wanted to build the CDU in as well. So uh, we've achieved that and I think it's probably the third or fourth iteration of it.